to use a little bit of common sense. So C reads, if each filling machine produces 130,000 boxes per shift, so we're talking, we're going to quote these in boxes, how many boxes, of course, will lie within the acceptable range? Well, we know that 22.78 are rejected. So 0 0.2278, if we actually think about it, 77.22% are going to be good. Happy face. Okay, that means out of 130,000 boxes, we're going to take 77.22% of them. 30,000 times 0.7722. Okay, so 100,386 boxes will be accepted. Okay, it'll be in that acceptable range. Now, if you own this company, what conclusions might you reach about your current production process? Well, in my opinion, if you're rejecting like almost a quarter, like one out of every five boxes, this is too many. I would definitely try to be more accurate and more efficient with that. Um, how we can do that, I mean, I think that it would be important to get that standard deviation down because if we drew go yellow. Okay, if we drew that standard deviation, okay, in the middle it would be 48, and then the first standard deviation away from the mean is 40, or 52.3. Two standard deviations away from the mean, 56.6, and three standard deviations away from the mean, you know what, only two standard deviations away from the mean, we're already rejecting a lot here going up. And when we subtract 48 minus 4.3, 43.7. And only 43.7. And only one standard deviation away from the mean going down, we're already rejecting. So I think that it would be important to lower the standard deviation.